Okay, welcome back to another magic video. Today we're going to teach you how to tell if a deck of cards is marked or not. To do that, we're going to use a deck of tally ho cards. Let me first show you something about a deck of tally ho cards. Anywhere in the world you go and you get tally ho cards, there's always four main words on the card case A Doggerty, Tally Ho, Playing, and Cards. Always those four main words A Doggerty, Tally Ho, Playing, and Cards. So the first thing we do in order to tell if the deck is marked, we'll just pick out one of those words. Let's use tally ho. Watch. T A L L Y H O. How about A Doggerty? A D O U G H E R T Y. Then how about cards? C A R D S. And the last word is playing. P L A Y I N G. And I just pick these up. And I always give it a couple of cuts. Okay, now we're going to spell the words back, but this time in the order on the card case. So the first word is a doggerty. Watch. A D O U G H E R T. There's the Y. Then tally ho. T A L L Y H. There's the O. Then playing. P L A Y I N. There's the G. Then cards. C A R D, there's the S. Okay. Most people also don't realize why there's a number nine on every deck of tally ho cards anywhere in the world. There's always that number nine. There's a reason for that nine. If after you've done all this, you get the four nines, you know the deck is marked, and you don't play with it. Oops, we got the sixes, not the nines. <laughs> all right, well, I'll tell you what, let's just try something different here. There is the first nine. And there is the second nine. There's the third nine. And there is the fourth nine. And that's four nines. And no, they're not all nines. And that's how you tell if a deck of cards is marked or not. My name is John Bieber. Thank you very much, and we'll see you next time.